like Lisa has no respect for me. I know, I know. I'm finally good at something, and she has to make it into a competition. That must be really hard for you. It is. I'm so sorry you have to go through this. Thank you. Mom's always trying to hold me back. I know, I know. I can't be her little girl forever. That must be really hard for you. It is. I'm so sorry you have to go through this. Thank you. That listening to women junk you taught me really works. The trick is in the nodding. Dad, after seeing your mom and Lisa go at it, I'm glad our relationship is about physical abuse, not psychological. Me too, boy. Uh... This press conference was originally scheduled to introduce our 10 Mars mission finalists. However, our rivals at Space Colony 1, a division of Pepperidge Farms, just announced that their Mars rocket is nearing completion. We made a solemn promise to Fig Glutens that they would be the first cookie on Mars. Therefore, we have moved up our launch date from 2026 to Thursday. Thursday? This Thursday? Are you all ready to be a part of history? I wanted to be someone who's bravely going to Mars eventually. I haven't used my open table dining I'm points. I'm still very much an alcoholic. <sighs> I guess we should leave too. I knew it. What? This has all been an elaborate charade. You never had the guts to go to Mars. Oh, I have the guts. I once went to a rock concert by myself in the rain. It was lover boy. Then let's go to Mars. Yeah, let's go to Mars. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, mankind's first residence of Mars, powered by simmer time dinner sauces. Dinner time is simmer time for sauce. <laughs> They're leaving in a week? Mom's my only good parent. And Lisa's my only good kid. Why won't they admit that neither of them actually wants to go to Mars? I'm not giving up yet. There's got to be a limit to their stubbornness, right? T-minus one minute to launch. Here we go, I guess. Yep, we're doing this, apparently. I'm sorry I doubted you, Mom. There's no one I would rather go to Mars with. I love you, sweetie. I love you, too. I don't want to go! This is the stupidest idea we ever had! Abort launch! That's a negative. I think you're forgetting the motto of Blue Bronco. Let's do this thing. Twelve. Eleven. This is not happening. Do you know how to run the dishwasher? Of course not. Maybe we can use paper plates. Where the hell do we get those? March, no! Three. It's not a real rocket. It's the outside of a real rocket. We did plan to build a real rocket, and that's one thing they can never take away from us. That plan is our legacy. Then why did you move up the launch if you knew it was fake? To inspire the next generation. And to provide a distraction while we drove away. Then why are you still here? Our car wouldn't start. Mom, doesn't it frighten you that we almost went to Mars out of sheer stubbornness? That's what a mother-daughter relationship is, sweetie. A series of near-fatal emotional standoffs. Okay, but it doesn't have to be that way. Surely we can learn from this. One day we'll figure it out. On this planet or another. It's my life! If I want to leave Mars and move to Venus, you can't stop me! <sighs> Mom's always trying to hold me back. I know, I know. I can't be her little girl forever. That must be really hard for you. It is. Nodbot is so sorry you have to go through this. Thank you.